To be honest with you, I can't remember if I sang Goat's Praises last time, but I do remember liking the flavor of the drink and liking the energy from the drink. So here we are, Goat Fuel Candy. This is the most simple name I have ever seen on a freaking energy drink. It's pink. I think cotton candy when I think pink. Uh, yeah. So maybe it's cotton candy, I guess, because Bang has one. Rain, I think, has a cotton candy. So maybe go out here with the cotton candy. They had the gummy worm. Now the cotton candy. I don't know. Let's find out. I'm excited. 200 milligrams of caffeine, if you didn't remember, which means I could drink about half of one of these. Or I can drink it all. There are no rules. It's not going to kill it. Don't, don't take that to heart. It could kill someone. Shouldn't. Hmm. It smells fruit punchy, which is really throwing off this pink vibe for me. Gosh, I promise I'm not bald. I have hair, see? I don't like this angle. Anyway, it smells very fruit punchy to me, which is concerning because I wanted cotton candy looking at this dang candy. Does not taste anything like cotton candy. Tastes like fruit punch, which kind of sucks because everything has a fruit punch flavor, which is boring. But if it's the same energy it gave me last time, I will drink this. I will drink this any day. And it has what? 15 calories, one gram of carbs. If you know macros, you know that doesn't make any damn dang darn whatever sense. Mm -hmm -hmm. Some random vitamins, you know what's up. Green tea powder is our caffeine. You don't really care. It also has natural caffeine. Great, love that. Anywho, very disappointed that this does not taste like cotton candy. Wish it did. Tastes like fruit punch. Overall, we'll give it a six out of 10 for the flavor. But as I've said before, I really like the energy that they give me. So it would probably be an eight out of 10 on that average. Anyway. If you find this, you're not missing out. Get the freaking gummy whatever one.